Hey, we're glad that the weather's still quiet today and for the next couple of days, so no issues there. But by the end of the week, things get more active. We likely have some rain building in, but on either side of it, there may be some wintry weather. The highest risk is in western Maryland. Uh, frigid, though, by Christmas weekend, that's pretty much a guarantee. Right now, we've had scattered flurries across the region, but not an issue here in the Baltimore area. Uh, more slick spots are possible as you travel north from Garrett County to the Pittsburgh area. That's where the snow is ongoing right now. And temperatures are colder off to the north and west. Uh, York at 31 degrees, Hereford at 33, but Baltimore 36 at the airport, 38 downtown and Easton right now at 36. We'll have dry weather today. The temperatures will bottom out in the 30s and then climb to the low 40s this afternoon. Keep in mind the breeze. You felt it yesterday. It's out there again today and that brisk wind adds a wind chill. It'll feel like it's stuck in the 30s uh, much of today, but we'll be dry with increasing clouds and then it clears out this evening for the first night of Hanukkah. Tonight, colder temperatures are falling down into the 20s with clear skies. Tomorrow, a lot more sunshine. I know that helps a little. Keep in mind the brisk wind, though. Still that breeze out of the west and the temperatures upper 30s to low 40s. At least it's a very quiet start to the work week because things get more active towards the end. We have a big storm system forming across the country. I know a lot of you have been hearing a lot about this. I will say, though, that the models are trending away from snow here more to a rain, uh, pro most likely because it's coming in two different pieces. So we've got the really cold air in the Midwest. That's where a lot of the snow will start, but there's this moisture coming up from the south. And I don't think these two are really linking up together to give a big snow event for Baltimore. So it more likely starts as rain here, although there's still a slight risk for wintry weather early Thursday, so I'd keep an eye on that. But uh, especially the case Western Maryland, Pennsylvania, that could be a place that looks more wintry early Thursday before this changes more to a rain. The second piece, though, that's another one we'll have to watch could bring additional snow to the mountains and then maybe it causes us to turn icy on Friday night. So here's how the breakdown looks. If you're trying to travel later this week, Wednesday is obviously your better day. It's completely dry. Thursday looks more like rain, but if you're going north and west, that's where it could be icy or snowy. And then we might get a break in the rain Thursday night until we get the second piece Friday with some rain showers and that might end as a mix. Uh, maybe icy at night as we get a flash freeze. Heavier snow, though, western Maryland and Pennsylvania heading in that direction. I would try to avoid traveling Thursday and Friday if you could. 7 day forecast dry for the next couple of days with highs in the 40s. Stay aware of the forecast Thursday, Friday to see if anything changes. Then Saturday, that's Christmas Eve. Look how cold it is for the Ravens game in the 20s.